This is Ryan Helling with Swift Shore Yachts in Seattle, and uh, we're going to take a video tour of Papa. She's a 2016 Jeannot 349. See here the really nice whole side windows, a lot of light uh, in the salon from those whole side windows. Boarding gates to port and starboard. We have our fender step there. Nice composite tow rail, very low maintenance. Fold down swim step. You can see there's storage space uh, on both sides, open storage space, uh, possibly for a life raft on the port side. Swim ladder. Twin carbon wheels. There's a table in the center of the cockpit, uh, double leaf folding table. BNG instruments, a chart plotter on the port side. And then autopilot control and a multifunction instrument on the starboard side. Single lever throttle shift control. The engine panels down here, to starboard. Really nice uh, Iverson Dodger. Uh, you can see the winches uh, underneath the uh, Dodger here are for the uh, halyards and other control lines. Um, it's important to note that the main sheet and the jib sheet come to either side here at the aft winches, so a uh, person uh, skippering the boat uh, has control of the main sheet and the head sail sheets right here from the aft end of the boat. Going forward, nice handrails on top of the Iverson Dodger. Uh, floating leads for the head sails so we don't have Genoa tracks. Those are adjustable from the cockpit. <clears throat> Great anchor locker. Quick electric windlass. Can see stainless anchor here on the bow and then Selden fitting for a bowsprit. Uh, and there's a furling uh, downwind sail. Okay, moving aft, deck step mast, stack pack mainsail cover. Again, this is the composite or the uh, performance pack. Nice wide side decks, even for a 34 foot boat. So now we're going to go below decks. Uh, companionway doors that are held by magnets. Uh, it's a really nice touch. Uh, coming down below, you know, just a lot of light here in the salon from those windows in the side of the hull and then big cabin side windows. Um, there are curtains and shades for all the windows and then ocean air screens and shades for the overhead hatches um, in addition to those ventilators. Uh, great storage uh, beneath the settees and uh, outboard of the settees. You can see the nav station to port here, VHF radio, uh, wireless remote, uh, fusion stereo, really nice and simply put together. Going forward, we can see forward cabin, V berth, double doors there, so we have a really nice wide open space uh, when it's just a couple of us aboard, but then we can close it off uh, when we have guests. Starboard side. There's a little wine locker there. The galley single bin sink. Really nice big fridge compartment.
Eno stove with that crash bar. There's an opening port here right over the galley. Nice lockers. A lot of really nice storage space in this boat, even for 34 feet. It's uh, pretty well configured. Here's the starboard aft cabin. Again, a lot of light, the nice mood lighting. Uh, an opening port there. There is a uh, hanging locker to starboard. Um, really a nice wide berth. Here's the companionway stairs. We'll open up the engine compartment. Really great engine access, and this boat's super clean. It's a direct drive shaft as opposed to a sail drive, which is a real positive in my opinion. Okay, here's the head over to starboard. Uh, again, really big head for a boat of this size. And then we have a separate shower stall aft as well. A lot of light. And then here's our shower stall aft. There's a uh, um, acrylic door that separates the shower from, from the head compartment here. This whole area drains, uh, and it's all a molded uh, sump, so really nice and easy to maintain. Got a little shelf outboard here in the head. All these lights in the wet spaces are just touch lights, so really easy to turn them on and off, waterproof. So now we're looking into the garage space uh, aft of the head. This is the port quarter. Uh, you can see the rolled up spinnaker there. Uh, it's an escape hatch aft. And then we have some uh, nice storage space over to starboard. Uh, the batteries uh, are beneath this. Uh, it's a really nice to have this uh, storage space here. Here's a look back into the head. Okay, uh, 2016 Juno uh, 349. Uh, she's at our dock uh, on Lake Union. Uh, give us a call uh, if you have any questions.